Hi, I'm Dan. This is a little video about how we're shortening up this little uh, Atlas 10-inch lathe. We're going to turn it into a production lathe. Uh, we've been doing quite a bit of work on the bed. This started out as a 54-inch bed, which was well-worn. Uh, we've taken and ended up and shortened it up. We've drilled it for the bolt the headstock on. Uh, we've machined down the bottom of it and built some uh, supports back up to clamp the feet to. They had a little more ribbing in them from the factory. And um, this is just to show what's going on with it. We're, uh, the bed was quite worn when we first got it, and um, we're just going to rebuild it, make it into a production lathe. Uh, the bed had quite a twist in it when, we, when I set it up, and we didn't, I don't have a surface plate big enough to run this across. So I just did some kind of initial measurements. It had a twist in it at the tailstock end uh, on the front of the way is why it was out, oh, five to six thousandths is my guess. Uh, like I say, you don't have a service plate big enough to set it on, so it's tough to get a real accurate measurement. But it kind of acted that way. So we've got a little more tuning to do to it. We've still got to drill two holes here for the gearbox. Uh, we've got a hole in the end, and we've got a hole in the back. And we'll be setting up some fixturing to, to do that, so we'll be sure we get that uh, drilled where they're supposed to be. So after that, why we'll sandblast it, get the, the bed and the feet into paint, and get that part of it done. Then we'll go on to fitting the headstock and some of the other parts to it. So I hope you enjoy this. I'll throw some clips in of actually setting it up on the mill and machining the, the back of the bed. Okay, well, we're just going to start shortening up this bed. We've got it clamped down, and we ran it relatively straight. So we're just going to cut away some of this other material we got here. Here we've just machined away the excess material on the bottom of the lathe bed. We trued up the the vertical surface on the headstock end and uh, machined the the bottoms of the ways flat. There's two bolts that goes through into the bottom of the headstock, so we wanted a nice flat surface for those bolts to bear against. Um, want the headstock end to be true on that vertical surface because there is one hole is drilled and tapped in there so we want a nice surface for that to go on to. After that we machine away what will be the bottom of the bed where the, the feet actually bolt to. There's They need a little extra support there plus we're spacing that back up off of the flat surface that we've machined from. Uh, drilled a couple of holes for those headstocks to bolt through. Okay well we've added all of the pieces to the bottom to go around. I've got to drill the holes for the feet yet. The three holes that hold that on. And we'll pull it off, deburr it, and smooth it down a little bit and see what she looks like. 